go dick around at the mall, apparently. I've got the master plan. <laughs> She's like, all right, Rain, hear me out. I'm what I Eggman. really like to do is steal things. So if you want me to have a good time, we're You'll going steal to the go. Master Emerald from no, me. it's like we're going to go quotes window shopping. <laughs> <laughs> By window shop, I mean you distract. I'm walking down an empty hallway, thinking about the weekend ahead. When suddenly, I think our study failed. Something failed that week. <laughs> failed at studying again. Someone catches my arm. Ah! Right. Damien. Sorry, I didn't see you there. You startled me. I'm sorry. I've been waiting for a chance to talk to you. Uh, uh Can we go somewhere more private? Uh-oh. There's no one here. I don't want someone to overhear. Where will we go? Class is over. So if we go into one of the rooms, we shouldn't be disturbed. Alright. It's, it's like one of my Japanese animes. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but I follow his lead. Here. Here. Oh god. As long as I don't end up like naked on top of a desk. Damien okay. takes me into a Prepare classroom. For editing tools. <laughs> for for blur this out. Uh, and then we'll, we'll put like we'll Photoshop like ducks and <laughs> just random That's shit. <laughs> uh, into the classroom and closes the door behind us. So what's going on? Preparing the sacrifice. This is hard for me. You can't imagine. You don't know. I thought it would be easy, but it's not. What? You. I don't understand how I feel about you. It's different. It's not... I can't control it. I thought if we were friends, then that would be enough. I'd get to be with you, see you smile, and would be safe for both of us. I can't take it anymore. I want your body. <laughs> uh, what are you saying? I want... <laughs> yep. You're right. I want you. What? I want to be with you romantically. I want to hold your hand and touch your lips and... It's like, hold it right there, Damien. You had a bit of Professor touch. Grabner coming at the start of there. <laughs> <laughs> I heard it. Don't deny it. He's obviously your father! <laughs> oh. What? It explains so much. <laughs> Daddy, give me a hug. Give me. <laughs> the reason I got rid of you. Yeah. <laughs> I shall flush you down the toilet like the others. Oh god. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Alright, let's I keep I know on. this is wrong. I know this is going to end in hurt. I just can't stop thinking about you. You're in my mind, blush. And now, I want to be... I'm gonna stop there. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. I... That's too far. <laughs> Please, I should ask but give me a chance. Go with me tomorrow. See, I'm getting all indecisive about this because I'm like, I don't know if I want to date Damien, but I feel bad for him because he's got, like, nobody. And then Ellen's kind of in the same boat, so it's like, I want to be there for Ellen, too. <laughs> Forces have to stick together. <laughs> it's true. This is a little overwhelming. Seriously, it is. Did I already have plans? No, that, that's just to brush them off. Wait, 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 no. When were we doing something with Ellen? I thought that was that day. But... We didn't do anything. Save it just in case, because I thought that was... So I think it's making you choose again. Oh, you think? I think so. What should I say? Well just tell him that you're not sure or you don't feel that way because that's pretty much how you feel right pretty you're much i guess and then if ellen's like the fuck man i'll be like i'm sorry and then we'll go back and be like i already have plans uh... i don't know
know if that's a good idea. You said yourself, it always goes wrong. All his romances end badly, and he's had a lot of them. I don't want us to end up hating each other. Isn't it better to just keep things the way they are? Rain. The way you are killing me. <laughs> the way you are killing me. <laughs> oh, sorry. The way... The way they are is killing me. I can't sleep. I can't think. All because of you. It's all your is... fault that I'm a pervert. I wonder if this is his changeling self, maybe. I don't know, like, because we don't know... Like, maybe he's being obsessive about it because, like, his, the way his brain works or something? Maybe. So maybe it's not just that, like, maybe when he starts liking people, he kind of fixates on them? You know what I mean? It gets yes. all weird about it, and that's why it always ends badly? Yeah. You see where I'm getting? Totally with this? not normal. No, but, eyes. But, but you know what I mean. Like, yeah. that's why everybody's Good like. Where he's like a creeper. Yeah. They're just like, eh. I know that things could go wrong, but don't you see? It's too late. I can't back away now. Creepy. You're not like the others. What we have is special. It's a risk, but if it works out, it will be wonderful. Oh man, I have to do yes or no? Damn it. He's a male, he'll be fine, don't risk it. Yeah. Besides, he's used to it. I just feel bad for him. Ah, you and your emotions. I, I'm a sap, I'm sorry, but I'm like, I don't really want to date him, but I'm like, god damn it. He's got no friends. <laughs> well, you tried to be his friend, and now he's trying to be something creepier, so no. Yeah. yeah. I'm too young to be friends with benefits, man. <laughs> I I just can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dramatic. <Is it> Helen. <laughs> oh God! You're now he's sorry. Mad. I put my heart on the line for you, and you say sorry. I'm afraid. If you cared for me, if you cared for me at all. You wouldn't do this. See, now he's just trying to guilt trip me into accepting it. Yeah. Who cares what happens to Damien, so long as you don't have to take a chance. Although, I I kind of get his frustration, I guess, because he's like, I didn't want to do this, you know what I mean? <laughs> don't say that. Look at the stress points. They're skyrocketing. They Why not? Be. It's the truth. You're nothing but a selfish coward. I should have known. I... Goodbye, Rain. I don't want to speak to you ever again. Wah, wah, wah. Bye, Creeper. Ah... Uh, Damien, was I wrong? If a relationship's doomed to crash and burn, isn't it better to never get started in the first place? But it already started. We had a relationship, just not a romance, and now... Now it has gone bad. Is that my fault? No, it's not. Uh, I still Actually, feel it's bad. All, it's all the male's fault. I still feel bad, though. Jordan, it's not real. I know it's, it's not bad. real, but <laughs> I'm just like, aww. Poor man. Ellen gets up early on Saturday morning and returns after the mail and allowances are delivered. She looks a bit more ruffled than usual. Is everything okay? I'm fine. Really? Stop asking. I'm oh. perfectly fine. Oh well. I think I'll lie down for a bit and relax until it's time to go out. Oh shit. That would have conflicted with the Ellen date. I knew it. They made you choose. I, you know, I'm not even gonna load that back up to be like I have plans because I'm sure he probably would have tried to be like liar. Not liar. Well, maybe liar. But you know what I mean. And then I probably would have had to choose later on anyway. Yeah. So maybe it was just better to cut it there. It's not like it's my fault. Totally not your fault that you crushed his hopes and dreams of having a life outside of his cold, dark room. 
You're not making this easy, Tim. <laughs> Plus, he yeah. did try to force it. That's not <laughs> the right thing to do. Yeah. Uh, and I'll never speak to you again. I'm so over that jerk. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> now let's have cake and ice cream. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. What, I don't know what was up with that voice. <laughs> now let's get cake and ice cream. Get fat, and then they complain about how fat we are. So where would you like to go? Wherever you want to see is fine. I want to see what you like to see. Oh. She's like, don't make me choose. I want to find out what things you like. I could drag you around and point to stuff and ask, but I thought it'd be easier if you led the way. Well, would you go to the bookstore? But I don't want to... <laughs> but I don't want you to be bored. I wouldn't oh. be bored at a bookstore. Yeah, I know, right? Of course I'd want to go to a bookstore. I can't go there on my own, Ellen. <laughs> I need a chaperone. <laughs> it doesn't show up in the menus. <laughs> oh, I'm scared of books. You know my dark secret. Oh. Paper cuts everywhere. Ever since the accident. I read, too. I do read, you know, just not that often. Oh. What sort of books do you like? Ooh. Oh, for a second there, I thought this said comic books. Yeah, I did too, actually. Uh, uh. I guess manga's the closest thing to comic books and the type I read, because mine's not in the list. Because I read, like, Warhammer books and. Well, the for art me, war. it'd be closer to mystery. Who's that to hold a giant gem? Like, it'd be like, I read mystery romance novels. So which one do you pick? I, obviously, I'd pick fantasy, but it's not here, so I'm picking mystery. I like a good mystery, or a thriller, so you're always wondering what's going to happen next. That could be fun, as long as it's not too grisly. Like your, like your uh, theater thing? <laughs> I don't want to read about serial killers. I only steal. I don't kill people. Right. Thieves code. So I follow Ellen into the mall bookstore. It's not very big, but she has no trouble picking out some titles she wants. After she pays for her purchases, we're ready to move on. Where to now? Music store. Oh god, we can't go there either. Ellen's taking us to all the cool places. Man, what is this? It must have been like magically blocked or something. I know, right? Or maybe we're just not smart enough to find it. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of the CDs, I guess it's Media Store. Okay. What does she want there? She doesn't have a CD player. They're not allowed on campus. That place sells games and DVDs as well, but the same problem applies. Well, I guess I'll find out. Ellen leads the way into the entertainment store, but she bypasses all the racks of discs in favor of the little carousel of t-shirts in the back. She starts flipping through them. They're mostly black, but not completely. And a lot of them have skulls on them, or giant fake blood splatters. Is this what you wear when you're at home? What? No! Mama thinks they're trashy. Ah, uh, ah! Uh. So you wore them before. Hmm. Or, <laughs> or you wanted to wear them, always wanted to wear them, but your mom's like, no, those are for skanks. Or something. If you wear those, I'll send you to a faraway school. Yeah. Yeah, she's right. And she's right that they're not the kind of thing to wear to school. And I don't get. And I don't go to the. the <laughs> and I don't go to the kind of places where they are. They're just sort of cool to look at. Have you ever been to a rock concert? Nope. <laughs> Do you want to? I don't know. Maybe not. All those people screaming might be better on TV. I wonder if you could use blue magic to make something like television. But with... Scrying. Oh, scrying. Okay. Yeah. Oh, but scrying. What's scrying? Seeing things with magic, like with a crystal ball. 
Oh. The mall near... The malls near my house have figurine shops with crystal balls and little crystal animals and, and things. Pastel really likes crystals. What about you? I like looking at them, but I don't want to own them. Because I know if I end up dusting them every single day, just if to be she, sure. Yeah, if she did, she'd end up dusting them. She's like, I don't want to own them because it's more things to clean. So she knows that she does sometimes obsess too much. I'm hungry. Can we go to the food court and get pretzels or something? Why are you asking me? Because I was hoping you would buy me one. <laughs> <laughs> I flutter my lashes at her and she giggles. Maybe. Mm. She does look more relaxed. I hope this trip of mine was a good idea. <laughs> <laughs> 